Keon Reeves, owner and designer for Cultural Detour, is here to show us how they're reimagining kimono fashion. Welcome, welcome. welcome. <laughs> Thanks for having me. And I love this because not only is it wearable art, you are wearing a little bit of history, right? Oh, absolutely. Some of the fabrics are from 200 to 300 years old. Really? And you, you source them all from From Japan, Japan right? locally. I grew up in Japan, in mm -hmm. Okinawa specifically. I spent 25 years there. These, and you can't feel it, but I mean, the feel yes. of it, the touch, and, and the little bit of a texture to it, and some of these, and that one is my favorite right there, right in front. Make a beautiful tie. <laughs> yes, that would have to be a wide tie to get the whole thing in there, but yeah. I would actually do that. So, and we've got a beautiful model with us too. We Interesting t-shirt she has on. Yeah, so she has our new Tokyo Cowboy t-shirt on. So it's a graphic tee with the kimono sleeves added on. And she's got about an 80 year old kimono sleeves and then she's got her bell bottoms on and those are about 300 year old fabrics that you're looking at. 300 year really? old fabric right there. Yeah, so it's called Boro Fabrics and I deconstructed it and put it back together into a bell bottom. Wow, oh, and that's nice. just one example of what you have oh, in your Oh, absolutely. Tape, right? So I do a lot of custom mm -hmm. and I started yes. with scarves, the back of jackets, all the hat bands that you see. I mean, we don't just use kimono, so on there is African mud cloth um, and some serape. Key fobs, bow ties, clutches, a little of everything. Our earrings are really popular. So let's start over here. These are some of the scarves right there. And then, mm -hmm. and this is kimono material on these? It is, everything you see is kimono material. How beautiful okay. is that? And let's talk about the earrings that are right here because the outline is kind of the symbol yeah, of San Antonio, right? this is right? the most iconic symbol in San Antonio. You'll see the quatrefoil on the river walk. Um, on the old churches, and so the four corners of it stand for pride, texture, artistry, and tradition. Um, so really meaningful to San Antonio. And those are pieces of history. Yes, and so in it's kimono the earring fabric. In that kimono fabric. So, oh my gosh, look at the one right behind you right there, how gorgeous that is. <laughs> how did you get into in, into repurposing these, all these different um, So models. I grew up in Japan and in Okinawa, there's a, it's a small island and so a lot of things end up in the landfills. And so I really wanted to stay, start a sustainable and ethical fashion company. Even fabrics like these, people just... Just like our clothes, I mean, it's what yeah. they wear every day for years and you know, until the Western style came along. And I love even the, the little handbags and clutches that you have and bow ties too, which are, are Yeah, beautiful. so this is made out of the obi belt that goes around the kimono. Oh, so it's a little different. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And then some of those beautiful earrings over there as well. A great yeah. little statement piece. Oh, absolutely. You can wear them with anything, dress up a black t-shirt and a pair of jeans. And so where are you located? Um, I'm on 118 and Broadway, right off of Travis and Broadway in the World Trade Building um, on the sixth floor. I'm a by appointment only studio. Okay, so make an appointment. Absolutely. Okay. I or love they can check you out online, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So what other types of, of clothing do you have besides the, the t-shirts and the jeans, things like that? Um, so we do full dresses, full gowns. So behind you is one of our full gowns um, that's made out of a complete kimono. It's called a tomosere kimono. And you can see the intricate details. Oh, that is. And a lot of the work on the kimonos is all hand painted, uh, all hand stitched. Well, and like that one right to Ted's left, right there. So this a is a Halloween kimono. It actually hasn't been touched. So you can see wow. kind of what it starts as. Gotcha. Um, and this is called kind of like the rain jacket that they would use mm -hmm. over a kimono piece. Got so, it. Oh and that's about 80 gosh, years that's old. Gorgeous. And of course, our designs have been in magazines, so be sure to set up an appointment and find all her information on our website, yes. Very cool. For more information, of course, just snap that QR code right there on the bottom of your screen or go to salive.com, click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. Yeah, thank you very yeah, much. Thank you for having me. Beautiful. Beautiful. I appreciate it. Celebrate San Antonio with us on YouTube. Yeah, all of your favorite DIY videos, food, drinks, tips, and tricks. If you've seen it here, it's on the SA Live YouTube channel. Just search KSAT. SA Live on YouTube and like, subscribe, and ring the bell.